How many gallons of water could your car withstand? How about 6,600? Automotive engineers fabricate Mother Nature to help ensure vehicles can better withstand the elements through high-tech weather testing simulators. This is the vehicle dust chamber at Milford Proving Grounds. This environmental chamber is used to replicate driving on a road, dusty road, where uh, dust and contaminants are looked at uh, to keep them out of the passenger compartment of the vehicle. 15 or 20 years ago, we typically just had single type seal systems on the doors. Um, this vehicle has a two and a half seal system. Um, so two full bulb seals around the entire perimeter of the doors and then another half seal over top of the door header. Um, does very well for wind noise, water management, water leaks, and dust intrusion. Global vehicle test specification is a requirement based on customers' expectations for contaminants that come into the passenger compartment. So that if a customer is driving in their vehicle, they don't want to see accumulated dust on their dash or their IP or their, their armrests where they're laying their uh, clothing and don't want to transfer that contaminant onto their clothes. This facility you're looking at behind me is the Universal Water Test Booth and it consists of an array of nozzles underneath the sides and on top of the vehicle. And it's an eight minute test that we run in every assembly plant around the world uh, as an audit type of test where we take samples of vehicles during the day, during each shift and run um, an eight minute long test where there's a total volume of about 825 gallons per minute. Uh, over eight minutes, which equates to about 6,600 gallons of water total on the vehicle. And we have people inside the vehicle with flashlights looking at door seals and any leak paths that are in the vehicle. And mind you, this is a completed vehicle at the end of the line, full interior. So uh, making sure we don't have any, any fit problems uh, or any leak potentials for the future.